Hello there. Um, so I thought I'd do this quick tutorial for my friend um, who's asked me how to use groups and how to make it so that you can mute a load of tracks all in one go. So I'm just going to quickly show you. So if you go to your logic session and go to the mixer, you'll find all your effects here. And you can see there's two kind of like square rectangular bits, one that says group and one that says VCA. We want the group one. So what we want to do is select which channels we want to go in the group. Now we can either do this on the mixer itself, so like this, hold shift, and you can select them like that. Or also on the arrange window, you can go like this. And if you want to um, select a track that's not necessarily next to each other, if you hold command and then click, there we go. But I don't want that, I just want to keep the, whoops, didn't mean to do that. I just want to do the drum parts, so let's move these back up. Okay, so I just want these parts muted. So what I'd do, I'd go to group here, all assign them to group one. If you've got them all highlighted, look at that, it does them all together, fantastic. Um, <laughs> then if we go to on the left hand side, where it says groups, we can determine what we want to group them with. So for example, at the minute, if I had moved the volume, they all move together. However, if I turn that off, I can just control an individual fader by itself. So at the minute, I've got them grouped. So if I click mute, they will mute together. So this is your options and what it controls. So it just makes it easier if I want to uh, switch off drums, though I've got them out on a bus. If I hadn't done that, this would be an easy way to do it. So. Nice and simple. And that's basically how you use groups to uh, mute a selection of channels. Thank you very much. Bye.